Hello Scorpio, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star, and welcome to your reading. So Scorpio, this is your reading for the month of January 2022, and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa, and time is fluid. Okay, Scorpio, in this reading, we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with. We'll we'll also see how does your money, your career, your finances look in the month of January. Okay, so let's get started now. No, I'm not yet done shuffling. So we have lovers for you. We have is eight of wands. We have is nine of pentacles. Wow. <clears throat> as far as your person is concerned, we have is page of cups. We have hermit and we have is four of wands. Okay. Let me pull out some more tarot cards for your career, your money, Scorpio. Let me pull out some more tarot cards for your career and your money. We have is eight of pentacles, then we have is eight of wands, we have is lovers again. Wow, we have ace of cups and we have is five of swords. So you may be dealing with a Gemini, you may be dealing with a Virgo, you may be dealing with uh, Aries Leo Sag. Okay, we have eight of wands twice, we have lovers twice. Wow, like... I'm really impressed. Scorpio, with that nine of pentacles, I feel like you are more focused on... You're more focused on your financial stability or maybe the kind of money uh, you're making right now is sort of encouraging you more to become more ambitious, is sort of encouraging you more to give your best every single day. Okay, what I see is something is encouraging you to focus on your career, something is encouraging you to become more ambitious, is something is encouraging you to explore yourself more. And maybe the kind of money you are making is sort of driving you to, to become more ambitious probably. Or for some of you, if that is not the case, it is just a simple motivation to do your best. It is just a simple motivation and confidence in yourself like, yes, I can do much, much, much better. I am talented. I have all the capabilities and the ability. I have that ability to, to rise up in my life. I have that ability to experience abundance in my life. Okay. So you probably are single right now and you are enjoying whatever you're doing. You're enjoying the abundance that is coming your way or you are quite optimistic about the abundance that may come your way. Okay. So your focus is is absolutely on your abundance right now. Your focus is on your your career, your goals, your ambitions and the materialistic abundance that you can have and enjoy in your life. Okay. I see something is encouraging you, something is motivating you to do to to do more, to give your best. Okay. You are encouraged to such a level that probably you are also working on Saturdays and Sundays. You're not taking a break even on weekends. I see you working round the clock. Okay. Whatever you are doing, I see that you are enjoying that. Work is not feeling like work, okay, and you are enjoying whatever you're doing. Okay. Secondly, what I see is that <clears throat> with the lover's card i feel like i feel like universe wants to take your love case your love case in its hand universe is like enough of you making choices enough of me giving you uh chances to to make your love uh, your your love life right now let uh, now let me take things in my hand let me take your love life in my hand and let me send the right kind of a person in your direction okay so with that lover's card what i feel is like universe is trying to take uh, your love life in its control which is ultimately good okay it's like there is there is a saying or there is a proverb like god your plans are always better than mine Okay, so if universe is trying to take things in its hand, then 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 always be sure that 
only good things will happen in your life okay so what i see is that you are focused on something else and when love is going to happen in your life like i told you universe is taking things in its hand and universe is about to send someone your way and whosoever is coming your way they are going to pop up in your life so suddenly and they're going to pop up in your life so fast like it is it will be you will be expecting that the least to happen in your life like it would be absolutely unexpected that's what i'm trying to say okay this person popping up in your life is is going to be very surprising and shocking and you were not expecting that to happen because your focus is somewhere else your focus is on your abundance your focus is on your personal growth your focus is on your career your financial growth okay and you are enjoying you're satisfied and you're content in whatever you're doing you're not sensing any kind of a void or you're not like sitting in one some corner and sulking like oh i don't have anyone in my life no not at all you're absolutely enjoying your work you're absolutely enjoying your progress you're absolutely enjoying the kind of plans that you have in your mind for your future okay so you are in a satisfied and in a content place okay and your focus is absolutely somewhere else and this person is going to pop up all of a sudden in your life and which is the that was the last thing that you were expecting okay like this person popping up in your life is going to be a big shock for you is going to be a big surprise because you were not expecting love to happen in your life when you were looking out for love love was not happening at that point of time and now that you're not looking out for love like boom love is going to happen okay so expect the unexpected that's what i want to say as far as your person is concerned we have page of cups hermit and we have is four of wands this person can be a twin flame of yours like whosoever is interested in twin flame and soulmates okay of course with the lovers card and with the four of wands uh, this person can be a twin flame uh you are going to feel extremely attracted towards this person this person will also feel extremely attracted towards you there is going to be a lot of sexual attraction as well okay this person is is not going to look of their age okay this person is someone who is very well settled in their life they are doing good when it comes to their career they are doing good when it comes to their money and their finances okay but they don't carry themselves like that they are very casual and easy going in the approach okay and look going by their looks you're going to judge this person initially because of their looks okay going by their looks this person will not come across as someone who is doing so well in their life okay and probably there is a possibility <laughs> that uh, you may dismiss them because wherever you are right now of course you are like now that i am manifesting abundance in my life or now that i am in an abundant place i want someone who is also equally abundant okay so you will be like this person is looking good i am getting attracted towards this person but probably this person may not be where may not be at a level where i am expecting them to be okay whether it is career wise whether it is money wise whether it is uh, maturity wise okay some of you may judge this person very soon without knowing them which i don't want you to do that this person is also going to look a lot more younger as compared to their age that may also be one of the reason you may be a bit reluctant around this person initially like you may think like they are a bit younger and people who are not comfortable dating with younger people uh like you may think that this person is way too younger than you okay that so there there will be certain assumptions that you may end up forming about this person so don't do that because if they are going to show interest in you and if you will also find yourself interested in them and if you have this this feeling from inside that no uh, i should be making efforts to know this person more and which you will be having because at the end of the day this person is meant to be there in your life so there will be an inner calling for you 
okay so listen to that okay do not jump on to conclusions or do not jump on to you know any kind of assumptions or don't have don't approach a person with preconceived notions be open to whatever or whoever is coming your way don't restrict the abundance that is coming your way okay so don't try to put that person in a certain framework that you have in your mind okay so make sure that you you approach a person and a situation with open mind because that's how you are meant to receive the blessings okay that's how the blessings are supposed to enter in your life okay so with that page of cups that's what i feel like you <laughs> you may think of dismissing this person initially but advice is to not to dismiss that person without knowing them very well okay because this person is wise extremely wise way beyond wise wise beyond their years and this person is very mature is very uh understanding is very loving and caring and very very stable like this person is highly independent a self made person and they have wherever they are in their life they have reached that level after going through a lot of setbacks and they have overcome those setbacks okay they have bounced back every single time and that is something that you should be looking for okay so listen to your mind listen to what your soul is trying to tell you listen to your intuitions because that's how this situation is going to turn out positive okay as far as your uh money your career is concerned scorpio we have is 8 of pentacles 8 of wands we have is lovers we have is ace of cups we have is five of swords so lot of hard work is stored for you guys going ahead and you are putting lot of hard work like i told you you are already very passionate about whatever you are doing and <clears throat> you will see yourself you will observe yourself getting immersed into work every single day okay work will not look like work whatever you're doing you are going to be extremely passionate about it and that's what you are looking out for for the entire life right you wanted to do things that will make you very happy that will give you that satisfaction where you want to do things where work will not be work and that's why i see you working like literally around the clock you're going to make some good amount of money you're going to and you are also a self independent person okay although you are going to meet someone who is financially wealthy person who is self made who is a giver who would like to act provider having said so you are also an equally you are not someone who like to remain codependent on anyone you will also make your own money you will also create your own wealth okay and you are already moving in that direction okay so i see you guys working hard a lot like literally a lot okay you guys i don't see you guys are taking any kind of breaks uh with that eight of wands you really want to do a lot of things and you want to speed up a lot of things uh i see clear cut uh, inclination towards entrepreneurship if even if you are doing a job right now i don't see you staying in that job for next couple of months or even couple of years max to max 5 years down the line you will be out of that job and you're going to start something of your own some of you you may partner up with your person with your romantic partner okay both of you may come together you may start doing something some of you are planning to go back to school there is a possibility that you may meet this person over there you guys are already studying for something that's what i'm hearing or you guys may want to enroll for some online courses or classes you're planning to go back to school college university or whatever okay if you're planning to do that what i see some scholarship is coming your way that's what i see you are a talented person and you're going to excel at studies with that ace of cups you will have an opportunity to really do uh whatever you like from the bottom of your heart you will be doing multiple things and all i can say is that you are coming across as very 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 passionate person when it comes to your work when it comes to your career when it comes to your goals and your dreams and whatever you want to achieve okay money is looking good for you guys and now with that five of swords scorpio you guys are working so hard you guys are going to make some good money 
okay you will be accumulating some good wealth make sure that you you entertain right kind of people okay you hire i see you are going to become an employer or you are already an employer you should be hiring right kind of people for yourself okay people whom you can trust people whom you can lead okay uh who are reliable enough to do, do the right kind of verification verification for these people okay so with that five of swords what i see is that some of them are some people around you now this can be anyone someone is trying to eye someone is eyeing whatever money you are making okay someone this can be even a near and dear one this can be even a near and dear one someone is jealous of you okay that you are doing good in your life or you are progressing in your life someone is jealous of you this can be even a previous partner someone who was in competition with you all the time okay so you are becoming the secretive person removing wrong people out of your life and then there is this one person who is actually dealing with you while putting a mask on their face okay you got to recognize who these people are okay a uh, travel may happen for work reasons you may expend some money for your business you want to expand your business if you are into business so i see some money going towards business expansion okay all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below till then bye bye